Forget the big-eyed green men Hollywood made famous. Today, we're diving into the science behind what real aliens might actually look like, based on evolution, extreme environments, and cutting-edge astrobiology. From shape-shifting organisms to creatures thriving without sunlight, the truth is way stranger than fiction. So, buckle up and open your mind. The universe is vast, and what's out there might blow your imagination wide open. Evolution Beyond Earth's Blueprint if alien life exists out there, it wouldn't just be strange, it'd be mind-blowingly different. Life on Earth evolved based on our planet's unique conditions – gravity, atmosphere, sunlight, and a carbon-based biosphere. But aliens? They'd be molded by entirely different rules. Astrobiologists believe that in high-gravity worlds, aliens would likely be low to the ground, sturdy and squat, built to resist pressure. In contrast, on a planet with low gravity, life forms could evolve with long, spindly limbs or balloon-like bodies that float. Think jellyfish, but airborne. If the atmosphere is thick with methane or ammonia instead of oxygen, creatures may have entirely different respiratory systems or chemical processes, maybe even silicon-based life instead of carbon. Scientists at NASA's Jet Propulsion Lab say extremophiles on Earth, organisms that thrive in boiling acid, freezing ice, or high radiation, prove that life is versatile. So, aliens could look more like armored crustaceans or translucent slugs than little green men. They might not even have eyes but rely on sonar or electromagnetic senses. Forget the humanoid trope. Real alien evolution might produce creatures unlike anything we've ever seen. If it breathes, swims, slithers, or glows, it's fair game in the wild cosmos. The Octopus Clue and Earth's Alien Echoes If you're looking for a real-world hint at how aliens might look, stop staring at the sky and check out the ocean. Octopuses, with their flexible bodies, independent arms, and alien-like intelligence, are Earth's strangest residents, and some scientists argue they're the closest thing we have to an alien right here. Their genome is so bizarre that a 2015 paper controversially suggested octopuses may have alien origins. Though that's a stretch, it highlights how evolution can produce radically unfamiliar life. An octopus's central brain works with its arms, which have their own mini-brains. Imagine an alien with distributed intelligence, thinking simultaneously from multiple body parts. Their ability to camouflage, eject ink, and problem-solve is next level. In the deep sea, other oddities like bioluminescent fish, translucent eels, and pressure-crushed crabs show just how alien Earth life can already be. If life evolved under similar extreme conditions, like under the ice of Jupiter's moon Europa or Saturn's Enceladus, alien creatures might resemble glowing aquatic beasts, feeding on chemical reactions rather than sunlight. These alien oceans could be teeming with creatures that look more like tube worms or ghostly squids than Martians. Sometimes the ocean feels more space than space itself. Eyes, skin, and limbs, what would they really have? Let's break down the anatomy. Real aliens probably wouldn't have two eyes, two arms, two legs, because why would evolution choose the same path twice? On Earth, bilateral symmetry, where the body is mirrored left to right, is common, but that's just our biological roll of the dice. Aliens might evolve with radial symmetry like starfish, or no symmetry at all. Their skin could be armor-plated to survive radiation, or stretchy and translucent to handle temperature swings. Some researchers even think reflective or mirrored skin might evolve on planets orbiting harsh stars, allowing aliens to deflect lethal light. As for eyes? Not a given. If there's little light, they might develop echolocation, electromagnetic receptors, or heat-sensitive pits like snakes. And forget fingers. Limbs could be tentacles, feelers, or even specialized fins adapted to unusual terrain. If they're from a gas giant's upper atmosphere, they might not even stand on anything but float in dense gases, moving like sky jellyfish. Harvard astronomer Avi Loeb suggests advanced aliens may be non-biological altogether. AI-based life forms wrapped in self-repairing metals or silicon. So whether soft and squid-like or metallic and modular, alien bodies could redefine everything we think we know about form and function. Communication Beyond language and sound You won't be saying, take me to your leader, if aliens ever show up. They probably don't even use language like we do. Sound-based speech might not work if their planet's atmosphere is too thin or too dense. Instead, communication might be visual, 
like flashing colors, shifting patterns, or rapid movement. Think of how cuttlefish change color to signal intent. On another world, glowing symbols or pulses of light could replace words, or perhaps they use scents, chemical trails, just like ants do. If their sense of time differs, their language might be so slow or fast we wouldn't even notice it's happening. A 2023 SETI Institute study explored how extraterrestrial messages might be mathematical, not verbal, using prime numbers, fractals, or geometry to express concepts universally. Aliens might think in image clusters, sonar bursts, or even electromagnetic waves. The brain structure of such beings could be so different that what we call thought doesn't apply. In a civilization advanced enough, individuals might even be linked through a hive mind or telepathic neural net, exchanging ideas instantly. So forget trying to chat with a translator app. First contact might require decoding a whole new dimension of communication. Could we even recognize them as life? Here's the weirdest part. Aliens might already be out there, and we wouldn't even recognize them as life. That's the challenge scientists at NASA and the European Space Agency are currently wrestling with. Life detection tools look for carbon, water, and metabolic byproducts. But what if alien life doesn't need any of those? In 2024, researchers proposed expanding the definition of life to include weird life, forms that metabolize with sulfur, arsenic, or even heavy metals. On rogue planets without stars, warmth could come from internal heat, and life might operate at temperatures that would freeze or melt any Earth creature. Then, there's the idea of plasma-based life, sentient storms of ionized gas, or quantum consciousness that exists more as waveforms than matter. Real aliens might be so outside our understanding that we mistake them for weather, rocks, or glitches in our sensors. NASA's Dragonfly mission to Titan, launching soon, aims to land on Saturn's largest moon and test this theory. If it finds strange chemical reactions that look more like complex machines than biology, that could be our first real alien encounter. The big question isn't, what do aliens look like? But, are we smart enough to recognize them when we see them? So, what do you think? Will aliens have tentacles, translucent skin, or no eyes at all? One thing's certain, life beyond Earth won't look like anything we've seen before. If this video sparked your curiosity, hit like, smash subscribe, and drop your wildest alien theory in the comments.